Season 3 has officially been out for just under 24 hours and we are slowly but surely finding all the easter eggs inside this bad boy. Now today I'm bringing you a brand new easter egg and this one is going to be how to skip rounds inside of Outbreak. Now if you just want to make your life just a little bit harder, why not skip from round 1 to round 3? Why not, you know? Make, make Outbreak more of a challenge for yourself. This is also going to be huge for high round strat guys that basically just want to skip over rounds. It's going to be interesting to see how this works out with world records. Hey Tiki team, welcome back to the channel. My name's Spesh, helping you conquer the horde. So this Easter egg is actually insanely simple to do. There's literally one requirement, have a pack-a-punch weapon. Now what you have to do after you get that pack-a-punch weapon is run over to the anomaly after you have already finished your objective for this world level. So for example, for me, I had already finished my objective, so I ran over to the anomaly and opened it up. Now, once you open it up, you're gonna run over to the beacon just like you normally would and click warp to the next world. Now, right after you click warp, you are going to use that pack-a-punch weapon and shoot the ball that is on top of this beacon like I do here. Once you shoot it enough, it is going to basically explode, fall over, it's gonna look like an older guy who just needs a little blue pill. For some people, that joke was totally lost on you, I'm sorry. So at this point, you're gonna hear some interesting sounds and then eventually you're gonna get teleported and once you get teleported, you're gonna notice that you should actually skipped the next round that you would have been going to. So for example, I was on round one because I wanted to make this easy and I skipped over round two and ended up on round three. Now, as far as I know, you only skip one round at a time. I did do this and I skipped round four and ended up on round five. So, I mean, it is a way to get up to higher rounds inside of Outbreak faster. And I feel like this is a really good way to grind crystals inside of Black Ops Cold War Outbreak. Because obviously, as you know, the higher Outbreak level you're on, the more crystals you earn when you beat an objective. It's pretty nice to trigger adding all these like small, tiny little Easter eggs into the game that just make things a little more interesting. Anyways, I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you soon.